Justin, uh, obviously you're with the, the coaching staff in, in your group. Um, are you enjoying it so far? Yeah, it's fantastic. You know, uh, love golf, don't get enough of a chance to play it. But uh, yeah, it's great to, to have uh, other boys out today and um, hopefully we can put in a decent score. How important is it to see them out of the comfort zone a little bit, you know, on the golf course? Not all of them are, you know, accomplished golfers. It's, it's important for sort of like team bonding as well, isn't it? It is. It makes it even more difficult when there's cameras around. Everybody wants to uh, to do well, but uh, you're right, it's fantastic. Also a chance to, for the sponsors and so forth to mingle with the players. And um, Gemma, who puts the golf day on, does a fantastic job every year in, um, in making it a good day. So uh, I, I think this year will be no different. I think most sportsmen prefer to get away every now and again and play something else and just do different activities so to, to get out here and have a round of golf all together is a it's a good laugh for a start because there's some awful players but uh, yeah it just just helps us get together again and, uh, and do a little bit something different enjoying it so far yeah i mean we're not taking it too seriously the other boys we're out here for a good time have a bit of laugh with the boys and was far doing that a dub i've heard you're a, a really good golfer how's it holding up so far uh, not real good. Um, I've been hacking around the golf course to start with, so uh, uh, hopefully it improves later in the day. Supposed to be one of the top groups here. Is there a fair bit of competition between you boys? Uh, I think Colby takes the cake and Hawley's pretty good as well, so I think me and Briscoe are battling just to keep up with them. I'm not very good, so I'm, I'm just here really for the day out and uh, encourage my team. I'm trying to give them confidence. If I hit a bad shot and uh, they hit a bad shot, then they'll see how rubbish my shot is and think oh this isn't so bad so I, my, my role in the team's for confidence really. It's obviously it's Wakefield at the weekend for you guys, um, what are you expecting from them, are you expecting a tough game because it's, it's kind of you never know which Wakefield side is going to turn up do you? Yeah you probably don't know what the, what to expect, obviously they're going to play some footy, they've got nothing to lose so um, they've got some quality players in their team and that, that are going well at the moment so um, you know they rolled us last time at their place so um, you know, we're going to have to do a good job on uh, Sunday if we're going to get them. Back to the Rugby League this week and you've got Wakefield, you know, it's, it's important you, you push on now and back up uh, the weekend's win. Yeah, I agree. Um, you know, important for us to, to bring the same level of desire to the game like like we did uh, down in the capital. Um, you know, Wakefield, uh, you know, they've always played well against us over the years and obviously a uh, last minute goal at the back end of uh, the game at, at their hunting ground in the, <coughs> in, earlier in the year stole the two points from us. but. Uh, yeah, um, we're looking to, to make a little bit of a run now. Um, important for us to get some back-to-back -back performances, which has been um, you know, missing this year. But um, yeah, I'm pretty confident we can do it. So you know, coach knows when things are starting to click and look good. Uh, is, does it feel like that within the camp? Does it feel like things are coming together nicely as we, as we go into the, the important bit of the season? Yeah, we're getting some continuity with team selection, which is, which is important. And um, yeah, it, it's starting to look good. You know, we certainly, uh, there's a good feel around the place, even though we're not playing, you know, fantastically well and winning lots of games. It's certainly the players are coming to work with a smile on their face, which is important and um, I'm really proud of the way they've handled some of the adversity this year. So, yeah, I'm confident that we'll, uh, we'll finish the, um, the season um, with a flurry. So it's still certainly, you know, belief you can go places this season amongst the, amongst yeah, the squad. Definitely. Um, so, we're, we're two rounds away from Wembley, the Challenge Cup. Um, and also, we've only got to be in the eight to get in the playoffs. So once we get to that, then anyone can win the competition from there. Obviously, it's going to be more difficult, but if you're in the eight, you're with the show. Everything's starting to go really well now for us. I mean, we didn't have the best start this season; it hadn't gone as we planned. But um, I think we started playing a bit better in the last few weeks, and training's been going really well. I mean, we trained this morning, and it was probably the best session we've had all year. Um, and we'll come out here just to. Relax today, take it away from it, not too carried away with it. And as Greeny said earlier, we'll get the job done that weekend, hopefully, and then look forward to the next week.